You guys sent me a video called simply, it ain't sus to kiss and sleep with your homies. Fresh and fit, apparently been sleeping together. We just gonna watch the video. <laughs> All right, today's topic. Uh, we have a little throwback here. We haven't seen these boys in a minute. Straight from Rumble, the paradise of the defranchised, demonetized. Cause some people made some comments like, "Oh, Myron, you uh, you know, you're gay. We saw you uh with with your white friend Eric, and he kissed you. That's or gay. You were in a bed with him. Blah blah blah." That's, that's like, gay. That's how I could tell a lot of people didn't play sports that's or were in the military or did that's anything gay. Like, uh, with other men where there's like a unified front or a goal. Um, anyone that's an athlete, anyone that is in a, a, a former military, anyone that was any type of situation where uh, you're grinding it out with other guys in some kind of competitive atmosphere. Yeah, I, I've done all that's that. That's just how it is. No, you it's guys not. You understand like how close you'll get. No. With, um, with guys that you suffer with. No. Okay. That's how you no! build, build bonds. That's how you build. That's not. Uh, that, that's not that, the that type of togetherness. Is through unified struggle. That's not you. That's not the goal. type of struggle where and, I want. Um, no. And yeah, I I'm mean, not struggling in that situation. Like that, I'm like, yeah, that's how I know that you weren't an athlete or you never did You're anything uh, with other. You're shaming us like the uh, women competitive do. Competitive guys. You're a yeah, woman right now. Yeah, very sad story, man. Uh, nah, bro. That's fruity. Only white people do the fruity bonding shit. Yeah, that's real. I will that's do that shit. More than likely, bro. You know what? You're probably a neckbeard fat bastard, and you probably never played sports in your life. You were you are still field. spooning a man. That's an alone sport. You have any other combat sports you train at? How many gym y'all ever? Well, I train in the gym. I train at TriStar. Do y'all ever get in bed? <laughs> <laughs> What about comedy? No, <laughs> no, but the thing that happened is that you guys are so afraid of being gay or looking gay. Yes, facts. You guys are so afraid. I'm, I'm not doing yeah, gay shit. You are. I'm you not are doing gay shit. One of them. <laughs> I'm not I doing really it. I don't care about them pictures. I don't, I don't give care a about shit about I understand all people. Oh, you know you're supposed to do it because it makes them feel included. I'm not doing it. I'm not afraid of looking gay. I'm not afraid of. I'm not afraid of looking gay or none of that stuff. But it's not my thing. If it feel like it's zesty, I'm not doing it. I don't care who got a problem with it. Look in a certain ways, you guys are. So you, you don't mind if I give you a kiss on the cheek? No, because I, I don't. Don't, don't, don't kiss me, bro. That's a, that's a, that's a different thing. That's a different thing. I'll put you in your mouth. I don't bro. want people to invade my privacy. I don't or like invade that. Invade my, my bubble. <laughs> my space, that's a different bro, don't thing. Don't do that. I will punch you in your mouth I'll because that's not the relationship that we have. I don't want no kisses from you. But we are a team. We travel. That's not the relationship we have. Sometimes we be in hotel rooms and stuff. I don't. When? <laughs> you dirtbag! It's me and you, you against the world. It's me and you, we were, we were me stuck, you we and sometimes your girl against the world. No, no. Okay. So that's pretty much it. Like, you guys are afraid of that. I don't give a shit. Go I don't for, give I don't two care. shits. And the thing that he, go ahead and go not, for it. He's bothered I'll about it. I'll put you dead People in your have mouth. Been, I've, been bullied in my, I've been bullied in my life. I've been said, I, they said shit to me. Yeah. So. What? I'll put you dead in your mouth. I'll give a fuck. And then I'm going to play the victim, bro. I'm a comedian, nigga. Good luck. Okay. I'm going to play the victim like, way I better than you. I really I'm going to tell care. people I got I PTSD. You, call, you, called, in, about you called in. You called in to scream about gay. cartoons. Nigga, You're screaming about cartoons right now. It's zesty, bro. That's zesty as shit. Gay shit bro. That's you zesty, bro. Two of them. Get out of here, bro. What are you talking about? Get the fuck out of here, bro. You already explained it multiple times, bro. That's zesty, bro. Okay, why are you hugging a white boy from behind when your lips is on that nigga here? Why are you letting a white boy kiss you on the mouth with his eyes closed and y'all fell to the touch? What the fuck are you doing, bro? If Myron was... These are good points! As you say, gay. Ow. I would know. Watch any NBA game. Watch any sport. What do they do when he no, does a good don't. play? They slap the ass. Is no, that gay too, nigga? That's gay, that's nigga! He that's wants to defend his foot That's not gay. I, I, that's I'll, that's zesty, not, bro. Hold on. He's going to be the first one that's to call zesty, anything bro. that is not gay gay. Do you're doing shit, this, you're doing this, that's gay. You're doing that, that's gay. Didn't he you say you was gay for dancing? It doesn't matter. It does, that, and that's the problem that I have. Yeah. Like, I don't care that you look whatever. You guys are scared about that. Yeah. Problem is, you're going to name, oh boy, you're going to chill with girls, that's gay. You're the I one that's girls. naming anything on the calendar that's gay, anything on the fucking uh, on, on earth that is not gay that is gay. <laughs> and then when people are calling you out on shit that actually looks sus, you're like, no. 
It's because you're scared. But who, who gives a fuck? If you actually really know who you are yeah. and what you're about, yeah. And who you actually want to fuck, that's you. Bruh. In the islands, we say Bonabati man. That nigga call me Goofy? Look at you, bro. You're Goofy. <laughs> that's Great. not bad. That's you know, not gay. Goofy is a bro, that's not zesty. You are a fucking <laughs> You like, with yo, a female. You called me gay for salsa dancing with ladies. I just started laughing because I've heard it before. This that's is not but zesty. Then, I, the same person is like eating He's gay. I'm sorry. That's not okay. that's either. Eat pussy is delicious. For not living with your wife. That's not gay. No. So you can live with your bros. I would no, never live with saying. a woman. That's, what is that's one thing bad. They're good, at, they're good at sucking. What is one thing? They're good at sucking. What? Nigga, even gay dudes got the beat on that. What the? Bruh. Yo, no, bro. dog. I don't know. I'm just assuming. I'm just assuming. I don't know. What? I don't know. Bro, it's on personal good. experience. Bro, you don't know. I'm okay. assuming. Okay, good. I like, like, like the same person, you know what I'm saying? Who's out here like literally laying in bed with other dudes. I have no problem with people wanting to express themselves however they want. It's just when you hyper judgmental, like Preach said, and then your personal life look a little funky. So it's like. Maybe you need to chill out on calling other people homosexuals yeah. or gay or anything like that. That's it. You're in no place of saying that that thing looks gay, like that thing's a sus or whatever or not. Listen, You're in bed with a dude. I don't even want to sit on this dude's bed. If I took you it, in bed with a dude? But you're calling people never, gay. Never, never you're happened to me, bro. You telling dudes not to live with their wives so they can live with their bros? That <laughs> You know what I'm saying? That's actually smart. Mm. You never tell people to get to eat poom poom. Mm. Never live with your wife. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. Never live with your wife. I was in the military for. I never saw no shit like that. Never live with your wife. Now I'm not saying there's not I... people who do a little slap ass. There's no, very few. There's no slap ass. But like sometimes ass, bro. people. No, listen, there's like one or two, but they never. Come on, man, slap ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, there's like there's like always there one no or two slap weirdos. Ass, bro. Okay, there ain't but it's no not slap that ass. common. But maybe I'm wrong. There ain't none of that. Maybe if you guys are in a team, or you guys play sports, or you were in the military, no. or maybe people do combat no. sports. Did y'all no. ever lay in bed with other dudes no. and then cuddle up? No. Did y'all ever kiss each other on the cheek no. or grab them from behind them? No. Maybe that's more common for y'all. So we want to hear from you guys. What is your perspective on this? And there's one comment that, that nigga that. zesty. Oh, mm, so he was getting his face shaved. That's not mm. zesty. Home, right? It's a full shave. That's regular. That's fine. Yeah, I'm just dying because so much shit. That's regular. That could be a bar. I was like, bro, it's just a full face. That's full regular. Face. That's regular. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> just, a full, just a full facial. <laughs> yeah, you don't. You don't need a barber to fully shave everything. No. <laughs> you just put the cream on. Put the cream on. <laughs> As a military, we used to always have to be clean shaven. I have never seen someone be like, yo, I, mean, I love their chemistry, man. Thing. I love their chemistry, bro. He's They're dead. funny, bro. He's He's I dead. swear to God. He's dead. I don't play about that shit, bro. <laughs> Let me get Y'all gotta stop playing, bro. Dude, y'all can't, dude me... can't be playing with that yo, type of yo, shit, bro. Yo, bro. We don't do yo, that bro. shit, bro. <laughs> Yeah, no, no, the mirror don't do you justice. Let me get that. The mirror don't do you justice, my nigga. Let me go. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me hook you up. <laughs> yeah, you looking clean. <laughs> we don't want to be beating up it's our dudes, that, I man. do not have a problem with it. Like, we know, you said it a million times. I'm going to say it a million times more. But the I more you care. say it, the more you say you got a problem with it. That nigga yeah, zesty. Like I'm fine. Oh, well, I'm fine. I don't like, care. Just like he does. Yeah, just yeah. like he does. <laughs> it's not. Listen. Uh, it's noise? not. What was that horse noise? He ain't in my friend group. I don't give a shit. <laughs> he can suck on mooses for all I care. I don't hey, care. Listen, I, but now I, I, I know. Right. Now I know never to be alone in a room with them niggas. I know that now. Good looking, bro. I appreciate y'all. <laughs> it's not good. To me, it's just funny. The only thing that's funny is just like it's the hyper masculine alpha male types who, when you just like peer behind the. It's like, how you calling anybody gay when you got this in your yeah. closet? We just want to check in on our boys on Rumble. See how they do. Your boys. You're the one. You're the one who wanna get physical with him. Pause. What? They propose? I didn't oppose. So it appears as though Abba and Preach are getting back at the fresh and fit boys one more again. Let's just drop down up in there and look at the title of this video, which is absolutely <laughs> insane. The title of the video is It Ain't Sus to Kiss and Sleep with Your Homies. Fresh and fit. This video was dropped not too long ago. I want to be able to go over it. I actually thought that their beef was done, especially after Fresh and Fit got kicked from the platform. But the petty knows no bounds. So let's get after it. Without further ado, the petty right, knows no topic. bounds. Uh, we have a little throwback here. We haven't seen these boys in a minute. Straight from Rumble, the paradise of the D franchise, demonetized. 
Because some people made some comments like, oh, Myron, you, uh, you know, you're gay. We saw you uh, with, with your white friend you're Eric and he gay. kissed you. Or that's, you were on a bed with him, blah, blah, blah. Really like, fucking zesty, That's how man. I could tell a what lot of people fuck? didn't play sports Completely or weren't in the zesty, military bro. or did anything fucking like... Uh, Wait the fuck a minute. Friend Eric and he kissed you. <laughs> you or you were on a bed with him, blah, blah, blah. Oh. And it's like, that's how I could tell oh. a lot of people didn't play oh. sports or weren't in the oh. military or did anything. Whoa. Oh. What the fuck is this? Oh. boy is shirtless. Oh. There's two men in the bed. They're both shirtless. His, his hand is on his chest. No. That's zesty, bro. There's no way saying he get out. And it's like his hand is underneath the boy's nipple. Um, there's, not, there's nothing. There's so okay. zesty. Thing like, uh, there's no saving that. Other men where there's like game. a unified or a goal. Um, anyone that's an athlete, anyone that is in a, in a former military, anyone that was any type of situation where uh, you're grinding it out with other guys there's in some no kind of competitive atmosphere. No. Nah, that's just how no it is. Grinder. No you grinder. No grinder. Like how close you'll get <laughs> no grinding. with um, with guys that nope. you suffer with. No, okay? no, no, no. That's how you no, build never real been bonds. That's how you build, I don't want uh, that type that, of bond. That uh, brotherly love don't want no is brotherly through love. unified struggle towards a common uh, goal. Note the and, self. And, um, Whoa. and yeah, Do not I mean, anytime someone love. says some shit like that, I'm like, yeah, that's yeah. how I know that you weren't an athlete or you never did. I, what I find so interesting is, is that, again, I'm trying to be as objective as I can upon the situation, is, is that um, how do you say that a man does not understand a struggle and are trying to get a goal <laughs> but then there's public photos of you laying in bed with a man, but you're essentially shaming him and not understanding men and solidarity I'm not doing and it. achievement. No! Although this is no! content that is no! out there. I, truth be told, I look at these photos, and the first thing that comes to mind is that this is... <laughs> this Yay. is this is some white boy shit. I, I'll keep it funky with you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> like I went to a public institution... Right, I went to Penn State University. I, I have a lot of experience with white boys in and around my circle. I love y'all, I swear for God, but the one thing I cannot stand is the amount of gay shit that y'all flick around each other. Like, it's just, <laughs> as if the shit is just normal. And the thing is, is that, and I see it displayed now for like the Gen Z and even the Gen Ayers, right? When you look at the live streamers, it's like an Aiden Ross Aiden and shit Ross, like that. And they just yep. kick around all of this goddamn gay, gay shit. shit. And I seen um, I Show Speed not too long ago doing some gay shit as well. Yeah. Even though those are black men, they've also taken a nod to kind of this gay culture that exists within young boys and they poke front of it. But the weird shit is, is that some of these young boys are actually gay. So it gets misconstrued amongst the whole. So I don't, let's just keep watching anything anybody that uh, crack them with jokes. Other, anybody that do that type of stuff or crack uh, them competitive jokes, guys. They just zesty. Yeah, very sad story, man. Competitive. You're zesty, uh, nigga. Nah, bro, that's fruity. Only white You're people fruity. do the fruity bonding shit. Yeah, that's what I'm You're saying. fruity! That's how I More than likely, bro, you know what? We You're ain't probably fuck. a neckbeard fat bastard, and you probably never played and sports. And you probably... And you're a booty goon! You're a track and field. What? That's you're a booty goon! Yeah, he's probably a fat neck... You train at MMA gym, y'all ever? I train at the gym. I train at TriStar. Nigga, hold butt power, they Trying to shame us. Out of calling you out of your shit. <laughs> you suck it, I mean, I don't know what he's sucking. <laughs> but it's probably no. a penis. Uh -huh. No. No kids on the cheeks. <laughs> what about comedy? I'm just saying. Even... No. But the thing I'm that happens is that you guys are <laughs> yeah. so afraid of being gay or looking gay. Yes, facts. You guys are so afraid. I'm terrified. Yeah, I know you. <laughs> you are. You are hundred percent. You're one of them. <laughs> I really don't care about I don't about care about bitches. looking I don't game. care about him being bothered. Like, I understand, about, I actually understand accident, what he's saying. But I ain't going to do this shit on purpose. It looks weird, but I'm not afraid yeah. of looking gay. I'm, I'm not afraid of looking a certain ways you guys are. So you don't you, mind well, if I give you a kiss on the chin? No, because I don't... I don't, I don't, I don't <laughs> that's, that's a, diff, that's a, ahead, diff, that's a different stuff. That's a different thing. <laughs> ahead, I don't want it. people to invade my privacy or invade my, my <laughs> bubble. That's a different thing. Yeah. I will punch, punch you mouth. in your mouth because that's not the relationship that we have. And yeah, I don't want weird. no kisses from well, you. But we're we a team. We, we travel. Oh, that's not the relationship that we have. Sometimes we be in hotel rooms. Yo, opposite asshole. Because we were, we it's were me and you, we and sometimes your girl against the world. No, no. <laughs> so that's pretty much it. Like, no. you guys are afraid of that. I don't give a shit, I don't give two shits. Yeah, and the thing is, it's not he's bothered about it. People have been, I've been bullied in my I've been bullied in my life. I've been said, they said shit to me. So, what, how do you fight back? I don't do, give do, a do fuck. Right. No, that's what you do. 
Okay. I just didn't know all that. You were like, I don't give a fuck. I really <laughs> don't care. I don't care. Hey, stand you, it, call, nigga. you called Talk in. But I will also say, let me comment on what uh, Preach was just saying. I think it was a good comment. In and of a sense, to say that you're so afraid of being labeled as gay. And I'll tell you guys, as a content creator, it is the number one tactic that people will try to use in order to try to shame you out of your position. No, oh, you not. talk shit about the bad behavior of women today? Why don't y'all just all go hold hands together and be gay amongst yourselves? Y'all talk about bad behavior and unaccountable women, well then you must just like guys. It's generally where these smooth-brained, illogical people, irrational people tend to go as if not talking shit about a woman's irrational behavior or thought decision-making process then makes you homosexual. It's the weirdest shit. And these guys having a pro-male or a pro-masculinity platform, it is one of the things that can end them. Accusations of them being homosexual. So that in combination with these sus-ass photos is something that they have to try to figure out a way to defend. You called in to scream about cartoons. You're screaming about cartoons right now. No, it's like six videos. It's six fucking photos of you doing some gay shit, bro. You only explained two of them. Get out of here, bro. What are you yeah, talking about? Get out of here, you bro. Why no, you can't time, leave bro. no man if you sucking okay, balls on the side, man. Why are you hugging a white man? boy from behind when your lips is on that nigga here? Why are you letting a white boy kiss you on the mouth with his eyes closed and y'all felt you? No! No! It's my ways, as you say, gay. Oh, I don't know. Watch any NBA game. Watch any sport. What do they no. do when he does a good play? They no, slap nigga. ass. Is that no. gay too, nigga? Yes, that's, that's gay. That's a funny thing. He oh, wants yes. to defend it so much. That's yes. not gay. I, I'll say that. But he's the yes. He's going to be the first one to call anything that is don't not gay. Don't slap my gay. ass, bitch. You doing this? You doing this? What we want, nigga? You doing that? That's gay. Didn't you say you was gay for dancing? It doesn't matter. And that's the problem that I have. I don't care that you look whatever. You guys are scared about that. Problem is, you're going to name. Oh, boy, you're going to chill with girls that's gay you're the one that's naming anything on the calendar that's gay anything on the fucking uh on, on earth that is not gay that is gay <laughs> and then when people are calling you out on shit that actually looks like you're like no it's because you're scared but who, who gives a fuck if you actually really know <laughs> who you are point. yeah and what you're about yeah. And yeah. who you actually want to fuck, that's you. Bruh. In the islands, we say Bunabati man. That nigga called me goofy. Look at you, bro. That's not gay. That's not gay. I'm gonna kill it right He's there, like low key. Bro, hey. you <laughs> are a fucking <laughs> That's not zesty like, to dance with a woman, bro. I, that's that's dances, zesty, bro. I just started laughing because I've heard it before. It doesn't bother me. But then I, the same person is like eating He's gay. I'm just like, okay. The same guy who advocates for not living with your wife, yo, so you can live with your bros, yo. If you is saying never live with a wife, what is one thing they're gonna, they're, never they're live gonna with suck a wife. What is one thing they're gonna sucking? Nigga, even gay dudes got the beat on that. What the? Bruh. Oh, no, dog. That's, I don't know. I'm just assuming. I'm just assuming. I don't know. Why? Oh. I don't know. Bro, on personal good. experience. Bro, you don't know. Oh, he I'm knows. Assuming. Okay, good. Oh, like, he like, knows. Like, the same person. You know what I'm saying? Who's out here like literally laying in bed with other dudes? I have no problem with people. Wait, hold up. So did he say that even gay people suck better than women? That's what uh, he said. Pause. <laughs> Yo, this shit is so crazy. So remember I said before that, you know, I went to a school where I would see, you know, white people doing gay shit. Yep. The thing is within black culture, there's su especially because I'm from New York, yep. there's such a, a anti- Gay, anti -gay. you know, do I'm shit. From. I mean, shit. Like we don't do that. back in the late nineties, we would say no homo, and then that shit got kind of canceled. We don't do that. <laughs> so then yeah. people promoted to saying pause, and now it's to the degree you can say some normal ass shit. I can say some shit to my friends right now, like, "Hey, yo, I was just hanging with my man's last night." Pause. <laughs> like even shit like that is like, "Yo, hey, yo, watch your mouth. Watch the way you talking around here. You understand me?" And the majority of it is done out of pure comedy, but also too, ninety percent of comedy is truth. That's what makes it funny. Is that there's a degree of truthfulness in the way that you talk about different things. And I understand that these guys live stream for hours on end, and a degree of stress. Right, like, and there's some things that you say that might come through as pause and the homo, but for goddamn, for no one to hold him accountable, say an AO somewhere in the back of the studio, hey, yo, hold your man's hey, accountable, bro. Hey, it's yo. just wild. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. Hey, the yo. Dating that is just what? crazy to me. Man, man, what are you doing? Really want. It's just when you hyper judgmental, like Preach said, and then 
your personal life look a little funky. So it's like, maybe you need to chill out on calling other people homosexuals yeah, or gay or anything yeah, like that. Yeah, That's it. Else. You're in no place of saying that that thing looks gay, like that thing's a sus or whatever or not. You're in bed with a dude. I don't even want to sit on this dude's bed. If I took you it, in yeah. bed with a dude, it's but weird. you're calling people gay, you're fucked up. You telling dudes not to live with their wives so they can live with their bros? That's actually <laughs> smart. I would you never live saying? with a female. Is that true? You don't live with your wife. That's smart. Mm. That's, I'm gonna be that's honest with pretty you, bro. lame. I like eating that. vagina. I was in the military for. If it's freshly washed, like, it's like delicious. But if it's now, not I'm not saying there's not people who do a little slap ass. It's not. There's very few. There's no slap ass. But like sometimes no, that's that's that's. It's like one or two, but they never. Yeah. 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 There's like there's like always one or two weirdos, okay? But it's not that common. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe if you guys are in a team, or you guys play sports, or you were in the military, or maybe people do combat sports. Did y'all ever lay in bed with other dudes and then cuddle no. up? Did no. y'all ever kiss each other on the cheek or no, grab them from nigga. behind men? No, maybe nigga. that's more common for y'all. So we want to hear from you guys. What is your perspective Absolutely on this? Not. I've done martial arts. I've done track and field. I'm also doing boxing right now, and I've also done weightlifting. Right. So the majority of those I would say are individual sports so not much team sports but even still I couldn't even imagine like if you had a road traveling game and you guys were in a hotel and you're also in the hotel kind of grabbing and holding on each other and then not only that but then there's someone else there that's taking a photo and then posting that photo somewhere online it seems super odd to me but again do i think that that makes him gay yeah. no I, I do not think that it makes him gay i think that he could be yeah. involved or caught up with a particular culture at that time here's the thing i think he just needs to say yeah guys it looked kind of gay it just is what it is it happened at the time i was a part of this team in this culture that's what happened Okay, I no longer yeah. do that grab ass weirdo shit no more. That would no be more. smart. Yeah, that would be, I, would, I would take forgive that. Forgive me and just move the hell on. If he said that, I would not see him as zesty. But the fact that he's like, man, that's not gay. That you're zesty. You're on the low, and it is, it is what it look like. This is 2025 or some whatever year it is. I ain't for that shit no more. Long, but I Come think out. that preach has a point there to call out other things that are gay, and then you also have that skeleton in your closet. Oh, I don't really look good. That's the truth. Nighty night. Keep your butthole tight. <laughs> it's fresh and fit, man. They they apparently loose with it. <laughs> loose. We gonna edit that out. 